Dr. Ashton here. Now we're talking about benefits of faith and spirituality. And certainly this is the town that um, certainly embraces faith, religion, and spirituality. Really big on that here. But if you've ever been in a hospital, you know that there's always the hospital chapel. Yep. Um, and every hospital has a priest, sometimes a priest and a rabbi. Um, why do they do that? Because it is so important when people are physically ill to support them spiritually. And, and sometimes, regardless of their specific faith, do we have a lot of good science on it? You know, we don't have functional MRI scans yet to show the correlation, but there's been so much data that shows the powerful association between people who have strong faith practices, engage in spiritual practices, and their quality of life, their emotional well-being. Uh, a lot done in the world of cancer with cancer survivors on how they uh, will heal and recover. And there are a lot of things in medicine that we can't explain. That doesn't mean that there's not a value in it. That doesn't mean risk benefit. There's no risk. Mm -hmm. There is a high benefit. And I think we don't always need to explain everything to, to see that it works. And is there a physiology, though, behind it? I think it's hard to tease out the people who engage in these practices and other behaviors that they have, but people, sure, and, and data supports a lowering of blood pressure, you know, positive endorphins, but just a better state of mind and mindfulness. And when you're dealing with anything physical, that's always important. All right, Dr. Ashton, thank you so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.